Hello and welcome back to my RC channel. I'm Andy RC and today I'm going to be making a quick video on the Cadex Nebula. Now, in a recent update to the DJI FPV system, the release notes mentioned additional support for the Cadex Nebula. But what is it? Well, to put it simple, it's going to be a replacement nano-sized camera for the DJI Air unit and the Cadex Vista. It's going to be 14mm across, which is in line with the current analog nano cameras out there, such as the Cadex EOS 2. So, there should be plenty of toothpick and whoop frames already waiting for it. The Nebula only weighs 3.9 grams, so it's more than half the weight of the current DJI camera. The Nebula will come with its own harness, which will clip directly into the existing camera slot on the Air Unit and the Vista. Cadex tell me that the field of view is going to be very similar to the current DJI camera, however it has its own quality setting and there's only one, so there's no low latency or high quality mode, hence the need to update the firmware on both units. And they are reporting a latency of around about 38 milliseconds, so it's higher than the low latency mode that we currently have with the DJI system, but it's about the same latency latency is the high quality mode which is the one that I use anyways and I don't find any issues with latency whatsoever. You will still be able to use focus mode though but I've been told by Cadex that the Nebula's sensor is natively 16x9 and you won't be able to switch it to a 4x3 aspect ratio which is completely different to the stock DJI camera because that's got a 4x3 sensor so you get the widest field of view in 4x3 and you can switch it to 16x9 but it crops off the top and the bottom so you lose field of view but it looks like with the nebula we are just going to have one field of view with a 16 by 9 aspect ratio but I should be receiving one in a few weeks time for testing so I'll be able to confirm everything I don't know how much the camera is going to cost hopefully it won't break the bank but I will give you an update when I have more information so as always thanks so much for watching please continue to subscribe cheers